Well, hello, folks. This is Pastor Steve Cape with the Hillside Baptist Church here in Hickson, Tennessee. And I'm coming to you um, on the inside of our beautiful church auditorium here in, um, in Hickson. And uh, just thought I would come and to do a brief video for you uh, to remind you about a couple of different things, of course, that's about to take place, but to also praise God for his goodness to us. Of course, today is Friday, the afternoon Friday. We've had a beautiful spring day today, but it's April the 29th, and in two days, we will um, have the very next Lord's Day, the very next Sunday. And I want to talk to you about that here in just a couple of moments, but we just praise God again for the first four months of this year. And I know for many of you, it has not been uneventful. Uh, there have been different things that have taken place and happened. We've had multiple people that have had different type of surgeries. We've had multiple people that have been in and out of the hospital several different times. But I believe in each one of us could say that God has been faithful. You know, the Bible tells us in 1 Corinthians chapter number 1 and verse number 9, the scripture says that God is faithful by whom ye were called unto the fellowship of his Son, Jesus Christ our Lord. It is with God's intent and the desire, number one, not, for, not just for us to be born again and saved, but to also have fellowship with him and to walk with him day by day. So often is a case that when a person goes through and experiences, again, what you and I would call problems or troubles, it is during those times that we can have some of the sweetest communion and the sweetest fellowship with the Lord. God has our attention. Many of you will recall and remember at the end of 2021, four months ago today on December the 29th, that our oldest daughter, Heather, would have another major brain surgery. Again, um, where they removed, again, the, the remaining parts that um, were there on the left side of her brain and uh, underwent just an amazing surgery there. And then just, um, uh, just two weeks away, uh, from today, or uh, from tomorrow, uh, Heather had another surgery where she'd go in and have her shunt replaced and uh, went through those experiences as well. But, but, uh, but may we say this, and Heather could say it, my little wife, Mrs. Cape could say it too, we could honestly say that God has been and is good and has shown himself faithful to each one of us. Not just us in our family, but you too. You could say the same thing. And uh, all today to know that how good he's been to us here at Hillside Baptist Church and our dear um, church family. And uh, we're so thankful for that. I do want to make a mention of a couple of things, if I can, very quickly um, here on uh, today uh, about this coming Lord's Day. Uh, now, folks, it was 24 years ago that uh, I would be called to become the pastor of the Hillside Baptist Church. Um, it was really um, what to Pastor Cape did as it was I I as much as it was and what God did uh, throughout the years. We have seen literally thousands of people come to know the Lord as their personal Savior. We've seen hundreds, again, baptized and added unto our church again throughout the years. Many of those, of course, are in heaven. I have preached almost 250 um, funeral services and homegoing services, and most of those have been uh, here in Hickson over the last uh, 24 years. So there's a lot of people in heaven, and heaven has been populated uh, that by many people that one time sat here in the pews of the Hillside Baptist Church. But God's been very, very good. And this coming Sunday, we're just going to celebrate the faithfulness of our great God. We want you to come be a part of it. Everything starts again on Sunday at 9.50 a.m. And then, of course, the morning service is at 11 a.m. And then the great evening service is at 6 p.m. Please come be a part of this special day here. We're going to have a barbecue dinner. I love barbecue. That's no doubt my favorite meal. I could eat barbecue in the morning and in the afternoon and in the evening and even in between. But we're also going to have a homemade banana pudding. You say, preacher, I don't like bananas. I know a lot of people that don't care for bananas but love banana pudding. And I don't want you to miss the fellowship that we'll have after church this coming Sunday. So come, invite somebody to be with you. You don't miss being in the Lord's house as we all need to be. 
And uh, so I'm praying that everybody will be well and all could be a part of a special, special day this coming Lord's Day. Special music is being presented and on Sunday, a special message that God's birthed my heart on Sunday morning and Sunday night. And so please don't miss it. And uh, you tell somebody else about it. And uh, let's have a great, great day in the Lord. May I say this to you? I'm so thankful for God's goodness and blessing to this preacher in permitting me over the last 24 years to pastor some amazing people throughout the years. Um, God's never one time uh, not to shown himself real and has never one time not shown himself faithful to us. And I just praise God not only that I'm born again and saved, but I've had the wonderful blessing and privilege to be able to serve um, the people that make up, again, the Hillside Baptist Church. God bless you, folks. Thank you for granting me that great privilege. Have a wonderful day. We look forward to seeing you here in a couple of days here uh, for Sunday school at 9.50 and the morning service at 11 o'clock on May Day, May the 1st, uh, this coming Sunday. Lord bless you, folks. Have a wonderful, wonderful evening.